Hi, my YouTube family. I have a Dollar Tree haul for you. And so, um, I'm going to show y'all what I picked up today. I found the um, emoji tapes that I saw other people hauling today at checkout at the Dollar Tree. So, I picked one up for me and one for my BFF. And I saw these stickers. Let me see. I'm in my room again, guys. So, I saw these stickers and I just thought they were cute. You know, they'll be cute in some of my shaker cards. I got that one. And I had never picked up these um, Smell Good stickers. They're sniffing. I think these are it. Anyway, I think these are the ones that smell. I'm not sure. But I picked these up. And I got these because I found the washi tape to these. So, I picked up these for my planner, and I picked up these because they look like fall colors, and I liked these, mainly because of the bears. I thought the bears were real cute, and then I bought these headphones. I finally found them. Everybody was buying them a while back, but my store is like five months behind, so or four months behind. We just got them. So I got some pink ones and some blue ones for Hunter. And then all these flowers back here, guys, I got to finish making my pins. And for my reefs, I'm going to be making some reefs. But I just thought they were adorable. And some of them... Look at these guys, burlap flowers. They are so cute. I just thought some of them were so pretty. And then I bought some of these to put in the pencil things that are holding the pencil flowers, the pen flowers. And then I found this ribbon with the pumpkins on it at the Dollar Tree. And then I found this one. All the fall colors. I liked it. And then I just got this one too. And then this one. And it says Autumn Fall Harvest. And then somewhere on here. I know it says something about. I don't know. That's what I got. This one has Thanksgiving on it. Anyway. I got those. I got these ink pens to finish making them. And some people have been asking me, guys. So, um, on the ink pens, let me grab one to show you real quick. This part of the ink pen right here, the bottom part, you can pop that out. Then you take your flower and you hot glue it right there at the bottom and you stick it inside of the pen hold it for 25 seconds so it'll cool down and then you wrap it with your uh floral tape and that's this tape right here yeah that's how you make them and then i got some more of these little pencil holders to put them in now and i bought more floral tape and now I'm going to show you all the washies I found. I found this one. I don't know if they're old or new, but they're new to me because my store never had them. And I got this one that matches that sticker set over there. And this one, too, matches the sticker set. And I got this one. And this one, whoops. It's like the, I just like the colors. I think you can use this at Christmas time. It's really pretty. And then I found this one. And I bought some of these little bags to put my paper clips in that I make. I bought this calendar for 2017, but I'm not using the calendar. I bought it because I'm going to do some fussy cutting. And this is what's inside the calendar. 
Isn't that adorable? I think it'll look good in flip books and just all kind of stuff. I got that one. Then I got Bugs and Blooms. And here's the back of this one. I think Fussy cutting a lot of this out will be so cute. And then I got this one. Bon Voyage. And then here's the back. I like the hot air balloon. <laughs> and of course y'all know I love the bicycle. Look at that peacock. How pretty. And then I got two scarecrows, but I put them in one of my things. I got this little owl. I got this because I'm going to be making a wreath and these two to put on the wreath. Yep, guys, it's my Dollar Tree haul. So all the stuff I got. And that's all I have for my Dollar Tree haul, guys. And also, um, I wanted to say um, for my prayer, Chain Warriors, we've been praying for Robin Sulowski's mother and for Kim and Rhonda Curry's sister who has cancer. So before I close out this video, I'm going to ask y'all, all the ones who are joining in with prayer with me, you know, the Bible says where two or three are gathered in his name, he is there also. So we're going to join together the ones who want to join in and are faith-based Christians. And we're going to join together in agreement and pray for Robin's mother, who's going to have surgery tomorrow. Um, they're going to try to put in a pacemaker. Now, keep in mind that Robin's mother is 90 years old, guys. So we're going to go ahead and pray for Robin, and we're going to pray for her mother, and we're going to pray for Kim. So if you guys are ready, and I'm, I'm sorry if I sound horrible, guys. I spent all day at different doctors today. I went to one doctor, and then they sent me to another doctor, and they did all kind of tests and put me on all kind of new medication. And, yeah, I'm not feeling well. They, uh, The surgeon won't do surgery on me. They, I need to have surgery, and he won't do surgery on me because my blood pressure is way too high, as usual. Matter of fact, my blood pressure was so high today, they wanted to put me in the hospital, but I begged them not to because I have an 11 year old to take care of. And as you know, my husband works out of town and he's in another state and I wanna be here for my 11 year old. So they're gonna try some medicine and I have to go up there every day for them to recheck my blood pressure and they're gonna keep trying to get it down because I really have to have this surgery soon. So guys, let's get ready to start praying together. Please close your eyes and take a moment with me to pray. Heavenly Father, we are coming to you today, Lord. First, we want to thank you, Lord, for the work you're doing in Robin's mother. And we want to thank you for giving Robin peace of mind and comfort to her heart. Lord, I, we pray that you continue to give Robin comfort, Lord. Let her know, Lord, that you are holding her. You are right there with her. Lord, please relieve any anxiety and fear that they might be having right now due to the surgery tomorrow. And Lord, we're just going to pray, Lord God, that your will be done. You know... Robin's mother is a Christian, Lord, and Lord, of course, we're going to pray that you heal her. But Lord, if that's not your will and you're ready to take her up to heaven to be with you, Lord, I pray that you would to help Robin and her family be able to accept this and give them comfort. And Lord, if you decide to heal her, Lord God, we want to thank you for that. Lord, we're going to pray that your will be done, Lord, not our will, because as humans, Lord, of course, we're selfish. We want to keep our loved ones with us. We want to be with them. And Lord God, of course, we want to be with you too, Lord. <laughs> I'm sure Robin's mother is, is torn. She wants to stay with her children. But oh, what a joyous moment to join you in heaven, Lord. Lord, I want to pray for Kim, Lord God, that you would touch her body, Lord God. Touch her mind and give her comfort. Touch her body, Lord God. 
You know, cancer, Lord God, is not from you, and we know that. And Lord, we know if anyone can heal her, Lord God, that's you. And Jesus, I pray that you do a miraculous work in her life, Lord God. And so she can be a testimony for you, Jesus. Lord, I want to thank you for everything you've done for these families. And if anyone's out there, Lord God, that needs prayer and that needs comfort, Lord God, I pray that you would comfort them. And if they need healing, Lord God, I pray that you would heal them. And Lord, we just want to give you thanks and all the glory. In Jesus' name, amen. Okay, guys, thank you for praying with me. Y'all, please keep Robin's mother in y'all prayers. Please keep Robin in y'all prayers tonight and tomorrow especially. And don't forget to give God thanks because we have an awesome, wonderful God. It's not for us to question his will. We just have to accept his will because he knows what's best for us. So with that being said, guys, yep, wrap your arms around yourself. Squeeze real tight, real tight now. I'm giving you a hug. And if no one's told you today, I'm going to tell you. I love you. You are beautiful. You're, you are special. And God loves you too. Bye, guys. And if you like um, these shopping videos, please give me a thumbs up and please leave me a comment. I love hearing from y'all. Bye. I love you.